Hello everyone and welcome. This is Dawn. I'm so glad you could join me. Today I'm going to be having some fun with the Whimsy Stamps Roar Some Skin Background Stamp, the Roar My Baby Sore die, and the Roar Some Word and Shadow die set. So let's get started. I'm going to be using my Misty Stamping Tool to stamp out the background. Remember when using a red rubber cling stamp to take out the foam insert so you could get a better impression. I usually put removable tape down, however I have a bunch down that's still kind of sticky so I'm just going to lay a piece of green cardstock in the center of the Misty. And then I'm going to lay my Roarsome Skin Clean Stamp on top of it and close the Misty. And I'm going to cover the stamp really good with some Distress Oxide Walnut Stain and just press down to give it a good impression. I am going to double stamp this because it's a new stamp and also I think my ink pad is getting a little dry and I have to put more ink on it. As you can see, it came out really nice. And next I'm going to use the largest Jungle Frames die and I'm going to die cut it from a piece of white cardstock. Then using my ink blending brush and the same Distress Oxide Walnut Stain, I ink blend the entire frame. I just keep going around the entire frame until it's covered completely with the ink. Next, I die cut the dinosaurs from black cardstock because I want them to look like a silhouette onto the card. I take the palm trees from the Build an Island die set and I cut them from a piece of black cardstock as well. I tape them down so they don't move around when I'm die cutting them. Here I'm just going to see how I want the palm trees on the card and then I'm just going to trim away the excess of the island that's sticking out from the frame on each side. Using the Rorsum Word in Shadow, I die cut the shadow from black cardstock. And next I'm going to use the scrap paper that was the die cut from the middle of the jungle frames because I don't want to waste the paper. Using the same Distress Oxide Walnut Stain, I just very lightly put a coating onto the white cardstock. And then I go over the walnut stain with some Distress Oxide Mowed Lawn. And I'm just going back and forth to give it like a camo kind of look uh, with the brown and the green. And I just keep blending it until I have the background that I want. Now I take the Rorsome Word die and I die cut it from the ink blended background. And using some liquid glue, I just adhere all the letters onto the black shadow die cut. Now I'm gonna to start to assemble my card. I cut the background down to four and one eighths by five and three eighths. And so here's a little trick to make the frame and the palm trees line up easier. I put liquid glue on the back of the frame and then I adhere the palm trees to the frame first. And then I can move my palm trees all around and not worry about lining them up because they're attached to the frame. And now I'm just gonna put liquid glue on the back of the palm trees and the frame and adhere it to the Rorsome Skin background that we made. I put glue on the back of the big dinosaur and I adhere it to the front of the card. And I do the same thing for the baby dinosaur as well. I put liquid glue on the back of the Rorsome Word and I adhere that to the front of the card. And to finish off my card, I cut a piece of white cardstock to five and a half by eight and a half and I scored it at four and a quarter. And then I adhere the card front to the white card base. I think this would make a cute birthday card for a little boy. You could put a cute saying inside the card as well. Well, that's gonna complete my card for today. I want to thank you for joining me on the Whimsy Stamps YouTube channel. I hope you enjoyed my card. I would love for you to leave a comment below and let me know what you think of it. We would love for you to subscribe to the Whimsy Stamps channel and their other social media platforms so you don't miss out on any upcoming releases and great inspirational videos. Also, check out their website for all their new releases. And as always, thanks for stopping by and have yourself a wonderful day.